Okay, so in this question, a system that consists of a single spring stores total elastic potential energy EP when a load is added to the spring. Another identical spring connected in parallel is added to the system. The same load is now applied to the parallel springs. What is the total elastic potential energy stored in the changed system? Okay, so in this system, what is the new energy that is stored? So let us say the energy stored here is EP. We have to find that. So first of all, the formula for the energy is given by half kx squared. So in this uh, question, instead of uh, having uh, the formula in the terms of k and x, we can uh, create another formula for the energy, which will be in the terms of um, the applied force or the weight or the load that is applied and the spring constant. Let us see, like F is equal to kx and uh, the force here will be mg. Let us call it F only. So X is equal to F by K. Substituting this value here, we can create another formula for us, which is like F square by 2K. So this is another general formula that can be used anywhere. It's a general formula for the spring system. So in our first case, when the energy is EP, I will say that the force is mg, so mg square divided by k. Now in the second case, when there are two springs which are in parallel and both of them are identical having the same spring constant that is k and k, so we know that in parallel combinations the k equivalent is basically the sum of the individual spring constants k1 plus k2. So when k is equal, so it becomes 2k so substituting the value here now i can call it like ep dash that is the second case and the load is the same that is mg there is no change in that so it will be mg square divided by 2k so mg square by k is equal to ep hence we got the answer ep divided by 2 if we want to find the ratio so the answer is B, that is EP divided by 2. Let us uh, even check the answer once. Well, yes, the answer is given as B. So with this, all the best. Bye.